Hello, everyone. This is the All Facts Podcast, and I'm your host, Harris Vicar. What's good, everyone? We're back and at this the All Facts Podcast series, here. I'm your where host, I will be Harsh talking Picard. about and lessons, as you heard stories, earlier, and experiences. This is now part and three anything of the Ramadan related series. during the month of Ramadan. Zen. And since all of the, the people that I've been speaking let's all enjoy to, that I've been speaking let's to, enjoy our fasting, even enjoy our time, with me as enjoy well, what we're going to do. We're just thinking Ramadan, so just zooming sit back, by. relax, it's just and enjoy speeding. this episode. And so, let's get to it. It just goes by so fast, it's hard for us to even What's pick good out certain moments back and say, like, wow, we've done so much. Here. However, and because it's car, zooming by so fast, time is just... This is now part three of the Ramadan series. But then... I've actually all read of the people that I've been speaking on, to that I've been online that it's actually a blessing that it's Ramadan as well that we are just thinking Ramadan that you've made an effort and just that every day is going and by fast due to the habits you've it encountered just goes and by the plans so you've succeeded with. It's hard for us to even and pick out when you think about it, time just drags. When you're zooming by so fast, time just time becomes a lot slower, and that is a fact. But now, I've actually you're feeling that Ramadan is speeding on, by, then online, it's a sign that, that, that you're actually enjoying a blessing that if Ramadan goes so, by fast, so if I feel that Ramadan has been that you is made an effort by, and that every day for is sure going and by from fast this. due to the habits you've encountered and, now, and the plans you've succeeded with. It's the time to with. think for me that and now that Ramadan think is about it to an end, have I made good efforts? Have I made the efforts that I needed to? Have I made the efforts that I wanted to? Have I made the efforts that I wanted to? my efforts towards good? But now, or if you're feeling that Ramadan is speeding by, then it's a sign that you're enjoying anything from it. So since I it's coming down to an end, what's so special by then I the end, for sure am and benefiting now, from it. This is what and now it's this the time to think for me about it. It's just going to be now about that Ramadan the final is 10 coming days. to an and end. Why it's important? Have I made good how efforts? we can make the most out of it? Have I made the efforts so, that I needed to? We all know Ramadan have I made is the a month of spiritual cleansing and purification from what's good, which we try to increase our worship towards good deeds and acts of charity. And the last ten days that I'm thinking hold even a more significance since it's coming down to an how merciful is creation. And there's a chance to benefit from the immense blessings of Ramadan. This podcast episode will be about it. It's just going to be about the final ten days. And why it's important only comes once a year. Make the most out since of it. there is an increase so, in reward we all know ramadan is a month of spiritual cleansing it is purification from the last Muslims 10 days in which we try to increase reward. our worship and good deeds and acts of charity and it's when many and the last 10 days spend and nice hold even 10 more days significance in as it god shows how merciful he is to one creation soul, and there's a chance to benefit on from the immense blessings of god ramadan and, and refrains salvation before the month comes to an end and since Ramadan and only the last comes 10 once days are year, truly a time to reflect, since there is an increase in reward, truly a time to reflect, in reward and effort, it is bound how you increase your worship and how you increase one's and one just knowledge. And, and it's when many Muslims choose to spend Allah. the last 10 days on Ramadan. So in, I'm going to start off with the, the inclusion where one soul, uh, soul Aisha, the mother of focuses the blue, on worshiping, pleased with her, reported God and refrains the of from involvement in worldly and affairs. Blessings be upon him. And the last 10 days are truly a during the month in of Ramadan, truly a time to reflect than he should have in any it, other time of the year how you and he would increase your worship and how more you increase in the last religious knowledge of and Ramadan how you see than he strove in the Allah. earlier part of the month so so i'm going to start off with the hadith i said i think i said this uh, hadith like Aisha, when the mother of Allah first started and now Allah, be this hadith is now reported beneficial because of Allah, because it says the prophet and would devote himself him. more to strive in the last more 10 nights of during the month than he strove in the earlier part of the month than he strove in any other time of the year wondering and he would devote himself more so think of it as a finish line while you're in Ramadan you're racing the earlier part of the month you see the finish line like right in front of you instead of complacency i said i think i said this hadith the finish line and then for starting now as you think you're Hadith okay, is now it's almost over. Beneficial there's because less effort. It says the prophet almost done. would devote himself more let's just in the last 10 nights of Ramadan than he strove in the no, earlier part of the month. However, what it really is is that, that you should accelerate. So think of it as a finish more line while, while you're in a race. Get to the finish, race, line. Get to the finish and line as fast you, you as you see can. see the finish line and after right that, you, instead of complacency, a lot of time to rest. You shouldn't start the finish line while you're running and then to get slowing down as you think yourself. Okay, it's almost over. All that effort just to get to that finish line. It's almost done. After that, Let's it's just all rest. be complacent. And you're, you're able to look back no, and don't say, put in as much effort. I've done good. However, and this is what it really to, is, is that yeah, you should I'm gonna accelerate. Get and, put and this is more effort that. so you can get if to the finish If you knew that you had a certain amount of time as you can, you would try and to do as much that, as you can, wouldn't you? You have a lot of time So for the final 10 days, put as much effort as you can. And then when the month is over, you can put all that effort just to get to that finish line. And you're going to be amazed with what you have done compared to your past self. And you're able to look back and say, I've done great. 
And this is similar and to another thing about the last 10 days is that it here. And this is similar to them. A very if you special knew that you had a certain amount of time to live, from you would try to do as much you can, wouldn't you? All of which are essential so for the, the final 10 days. Pleasing, put as much kind of effort as you can. So and then not when the month is over, days and look back at your outstanding the progress, progress and you're going to be amazed with what you've done in the past the year. But it also is, gives is when you put the effort to benefit to from replicating the specific activities and another that allow thing about us the last to be better is that more responsible, more aware with them. A very so one special of the source of the holy specific benefits from Muslims, especially all of which are essential for the journey of its inclusion for the last month. And so for men, not this only do one of the days in the last for the last ten days in which the Muslim everyone knows to engage in the most auspicious day of the year, but it also gives an opportunity to benefit from replicating the specific activities that allow us to be better and more responsible more aware Muslims. and for women so one of this the means residing in the prophet predetermined place within the confines of their house did was the objective being in the same seclusion it's a cough is last one of the and for men only this means residing in a mosque asked to spend the last 10 days in which the sole objective is to and engage in the a brilliant opportunity Allah for anyone in wishing salt in solitude to amend broken connection and free from the so confines and constraints and it means from the material from you this material to world engage for women in the worship of this God means residing in a build determined place within the confines of the house with the objective being the same broken and it's a cough is one of just want to get only back because you'll have more and more connections and you spend want time and prayer to be the best you can possibly be world. and enhance is a brilliant opportunity for and anyone wishing if you have the opportunity connections it is so what does that mean already and should probably it means this you i don't know maybe in a mosque then engage if you, in if you have the opportunity just try to do it build connection but generally you possibly have the last 10 days are also seen broken as times so when muslims try to just avoid want to get back affairs, because you'll spend more time in connections so, so even if you're not doing it to call, be the best you can, you can do possibly be and spiritually generally the last 10 and days are for muslims if you have the opportunity and since it is the final 10 days already so know that you're probably listening to the this. doors of allah know, maybe are always open for paradise if you have the opportunity just if we spent the previous 20 but generally the last not 10 days are also much, seen as not trying to get as much Muslims blessings try as to can. avoid worldly affairs. God is more time ever ready to, even if you're not doing it, upon us his most prized blessings. Can do. And even if we make generally the last 10 days are the last 10 days. And this just shows and spend more time how merciful so know that the, the doors really of Allah's Allah's the fact that if you spent 20 days on Ramadan and not showing as much effort and you were lazy, if you put a lot of effort, if you put effort some not sort of effort much, or a lot of effort and not trying to get as much how much effort you, you really can. want to put into God the final ever ready to bestow upon us ready to bestow blessings even if we make the most blessings on you just because the last of you 10 days that effort. and this just shows how merciful all, look, it's Allah's mainly really it is the, the fact that if you spend 20 days on Ramadan why is this so important much effort and you were lazy if you put no it's very if you put effort and some sort of effort why. or a lot of But let's just go in, depending on how much effort you really want to put so into the why final is the night of days? decree so important? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is ever ready to bestow Number one, it commemorates the night blessings on which you. just because of Allah you making that effort. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala first revealed the Quran to the Prophet Muhammad and may peace it's mainly through the angel the Gabriel, Gabriel during the night of decree. And it is believed and to take why place is in one of the final ten nights. A lot of us might And though the exact night is unclear, it's in the understand why. seems to be let's just go in. Let's just go deeply. So this is one why Allah subhanahu the night of decree so first very ayah it, 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 number one it commemorates the night in the name of that on which that's Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala first the Quran five to the Prophet ayat Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam may peace be upon you through, through the angel Gabriel, 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 Gabriel and it is believed to take place in one of the final ten nights and though the exact night is unclear it seems to be in one of the odd nights in the name of thy lord this is when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sent the first very ayah who created man from in the name of thy Lord. A drop of blood. That's when he revealed the first five ayats actually. Yesterday and in the name of thy Lord. It was right. Yeah, read, like read, read as in who read, created so like man from read a drop in, of blood. in the name of your Lord who created created humans from a clean cloth. Read in the name read and your more is the most generous who actually led the alam of the alam. It's funny taught by the pen. Alam and Sanamalam class taught humanity what they yesterday and 
it was and this right. actually shows like and uh, this is kind of a tangent here but yeah read like read it what man who read, taught so man what they knew not and this is actually in, in the uh, name of your lord who created now that i think about it because when i look back at the previous humans from a clean of adam idris or read and your more is the most generous texture god taught adam by the pen how to speak god taught him what they knew not god taught noah and this actually shows like this is kind of a tangent here but the taught men what he did not what know man, and this is taught, taught by the pen not and this is Greece, actually which is uh, the reason brilliant with all that i think about it because when i look that, back at the previous prophets really adam beautiful Idris, Arabic, or it's just really not beautiful them. how in the all this English was texture. the first first ever revelation God taught Adam down what, how to, to speak. speak God taught Idris the prophet peace uh, be Enoch how to write it's God really taught Noah if, uh, I'd recommend to watch the seerah of the prophet Yas Qadi because that was men currently one no. and this is taught by right the pen was taught as we watching it which is the reason I've taught before they not I not encourage you to that, watch that, it especially in the final two really try to gain as much knowledge as we can we'll get to that later on all this was the first first ever so revelation it says right that here, came okay, down so, to the prophet um, the prophet peace be in one of the quranic ayahs, it's really if uh, i'd verse, recommend three, watch the seerah of the prophet it yes, says call the again because as i was the night of decree is better than a thousand right months now, and this a thousand it, months i believe does not mean before, but i how we live our normal to watch but especially in the final 10 months here we're trying to gain as much knowledge and it's even more important get under that later this parting of ramadan so and the and the repeated declarations asking muslims to seek the night of in one of the, the Quranic days is actually asking Muslims Surah to be more verse three, aware it says, of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and his the night of to decree continue to strive and receive months. them. And this a thousand so months, perhaps the very fact that the night of decree is not we explicitly disclosed, but it's just is a thousand months of for us to actually keep trying. And it's even more important like, to understand you may that this ask why of is it, why and the and the aren't there de- why isn't there a day where asking Muslims to see the night of decree decree in the last ten days is actually asking maybe the fact that it's not actually stated aware it is of actually an opportunity and for us to, to continue trying to strive and, and all receive them in hope and benefiting so from perhaps the, the very fact and it is surely not an attempt to disclose is an opportunity that we are for us to actually mercy and we're trying. desperate for all our sins like, to be forgiven you may ask why is he better why and we should not try there day any prayer this day especially in the final time it is the night of decree and maybe the Mandatory Maybe and the fact that it's as not much as we can actually stated so we can is actually an opportunity for to us deeds. to keep trying and all and since and that benefiting uh, from I the said, auspicious night I, I, and it I, is I said surely an attack to show Allah subhanahu that, that we are uh, lightest for, for his mercy which and we're is desperate the, for all our sins to be forgiven and we're desperate uh, which is the uh, be better Muslim night of and decree. we should not try to miss any I said before that it was especially either on the odd days offer 21st 23rd 25th mandatory and voluntarily as much as we can so Ramadan so we can add up however there's actually a special dua to say and since that during I said time and the most special thing to say is repeat that which is the innika uh, which is the um, night of decree one what does that i said mean? before oh, that it was going to be either on the odd pardoning, days the 21st 23rd you above 25th 26th so pardon us and 29th the nights of ramadan it's going to be an either one it is said that there's uh, actually a I believe, special thing to say during the month the of reason during why this time and the most special thing to say uh, i believe is the reason why is because we are after doing me, many listening to different allahumma efforts we're showing everywhere a full one constantly Himbun, wanting the reward and, the, and if we say this what does uh, that mean oh, supplication Allah, indeed you are Allah, pardoning Allah, Allah, and generous Allah, Allah, you love to pardon then so pardon us it shows allah we're desperate and i said this before. it is said then uh had the fact that i believe and it's not on a specific day the reason do the why best we can in the final 10 days uh, and i believe the reason why is now that we are the importance doing why it happens and what we're showing everywhere and what mm-hmm. constantly and wanting why the reward and, the, and days, if we, we say this well, uh, try for supplication more but here are five well, things to do five things to do, do, five things do or you can yeah. add more stuff if you like it shows a lot of videos on this and i said there are five things to do the fact that i believe you can make it's not a specific day let's just do the best number one in the final pay and pray and Pay and pray. Now that we so know one the thing, pray extra why during this night happens or and pray extra during the final 10 days, whether how little or much it is, and why do something the final 10 days pray something, well, do something that you do not effort. normally do. But here are five things it's to do. More like a, five yeah, things like to do, or you can this add more stuff if, if you, you like, or watch more videos on this. But here are five things to do. 
that I believe and the next can thing the is to give a few bucks into charity. So, so number one, pay and pray. The final ten nights, just pay and pray. So one thing, give pray extra and divided by ten to give pray extra during the final ten days, whether how little or much it is. Do something. Pray something. Do something that you can do not pay. Zekat. It's try more. I saw some foundation that you will do this donation if the final ten nights, and if possible, you try to find and do many efforts because money spent for the next thing is to give a few bucks to charity. Something so either so number one or in the final step, 10 nights just have a certain pay amount that you can give away and number two divided by 10 to gain a certain amount from reading a certain and amount watching videos so the call for charity each day. history etc so anything you, you learn hey think Zekat, about how try you that i saw some foundation that automates you can even apply in the final everyday, everyday lights because if possible you have to find and do many of those because money spent for a cause forgettable is valuable and it makes your number three to strive for so number one evaluate yourself this might be the most important pay and pray number three evaluate yourself number two ask yourself those questions that need to be asked from reading Quran, do watching an evaluation of where you are and where you are etc and let this anything evaluation you learn lead think you to feel about how you can happy apply for the good night and that you, how you can even apply in everyday life because the more knowledge this, you have while you practice it, it becomes more applicable easier to and see forgettable. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala number three and one when making evaluate the supplication yourself. this might be the most important step but number three evaluate before yourself when, uh, ask yourself uh, those questions yeah, that need to be asked Allah. do so an evaluation go ahead and try to see the value and where you are and going and let this evaluation lead you to feel since the night of decree is good try to that you have done and just try to have done do and this ladder as much as you can for each night. make it easier to because seek when you see that value of moment forgiveness it's going to be and one it. when making the supplication so uh, i'm actually going to mention quote another before one here where uh, uh jabber may allah be pleased with, with, with him so go ahead and try to seize a valuable moment and what does that mean saying just every night there's a special time during the night of which whatever muslim try to just try to law of and do good as much as you can for each yeah. night. Every night there is a special because time when you see that valuable moment. It's whatever a Muslim, a, a Muslim asks. And so a I'm actually going to quote a lady to this life where they hereafter. Uh, Jabber, may Allah, it will be granted to him. And this moment comes every, every night. Of Allah, may peace every be night be upon us. Every night there is a special, be a special time, time during, during which whatever a Muslim asks for. for and a, we probably know what this is. It's just good for the night of decree or even every night there's a special time after you break your just which a whatever time, a, Muslim, a certain a moment will just come every every night where of everything good be relating to this so life or the we all know what to do with that it will so be granted to again in this moment valuable every night and every night number three is say or number four there will be a special time, time during perhaps whatever Muslim asks for Perhaps and we probably know what this is, is just chapters or passages the, from the Quran night of decree, or even after that, past, maybe after you break past the Quran, just right, recite a certain or time, you a certain maybe moment, which is watch come videos or attend a class everything where will the be recitation of the Quran is taught. We all know what great to do time that to put your knowledge to again, to seize the just any moment. anything reciting the Quran, whether it's and a page, number three, a page, or number four, one ayah, recite the Quran. Perhaps try to perhaps try to recite as much as you can, can during chapters the night. or passages. And number five, Quran, which is kind of similar to what we before, reflect on the this past from Lanta's writing of recite, the Quran. Or you so maybe choose the latest surah or watch videos or attend a class week, where read the recitation of the Quran is taught and then this think is a great deeply time to about the meaning and how it affects you on a personal level. Just anything reciting the Quran, whether it's a page and page, a passage, When I said like, oh yeah, whether it's a passage, ayah, or anything, look, try to recite as much as you can during the night. Look at the translation number five. See, which is kind of similar see to how four, it's reflect beneficial on or see meaning, what it really means meaning of the sure context or so choose understand the latest surah or the surah that you've because the more you'll understand read the translation and tips you and get then to the think religion. deeply about the meaning so, and how it affects you on a personal level and how when, what if you, you want to study the quran and with more understanding check when out i said the like to oh yeah the quran, whether it's a passage to quran, or anything then to look or Arabic. so try to learn Look at Maybe the translation and see, check out the way and see how Quran, it's which beneficial I believe or see what it really means in the true context. Just understand the Quran uh, because the more you understand, the more book closer you'll get to the religion. book about. So I like the context and the, the context. And if you want to study the, the Quran, Quran with and, and check out Quranic the way Arabic to the Quran and access trying to, to learn Quran the Arabic and to Quran Quranic Arabic. So try to learn ancient Arabic. Maybe not ancient, yeah, check like, out the yeah, way similar to the Quran, Arabic. which I believe is a. If you understand more of that, then 
it would be a lot easier um, for some the court, and especially when you're reciting book, it. When you're reciting it, and you can pick book, up on words, about it's going to be a lot easier the context and to the context uh, memorize it actually. Uh, the context so of the Quran, I'll just repeat and I, the steps. And access Quranic Arabic is uh, so just number one, pay trying to pray. learn number two, the Arabic knowledge of the and three, evaluate yourself. And number four, read Quran. And number five, ancient, reflect on the yes, meaning similar of the Quran. to ancient Arabic. These steps will guarantee if you learn to understand more of that and maintain your faith. As the more effort you put, the better. And on a final note, when you're reciting it, when you're reciting it, you can pick up on words. It's going to be a lot easier. It won't go to waste, and it benefits. Uh, memorize it actually. So, so I'll just repeat the steps. Aisha, the mother of the believers, may all uh, be so number one, report and pray. Number two, prophet, gain knowledge. Peace number and blessing three, to value on yourself. Kept number standing four, in prayer. Quran. Number so five, long that the feet, of the, Quran. the skin of these the steps will guarantee. I ask you, why would you do this? You while you, as the more I've been forgiven the for your former sins, he said. A hadith that shows the effort the grateful servant. It won't go to waste Allah. and it benefits any grateful servant of Allah. So and that's in so Aisha, the mother of the believers, may Allah be pleased with her, reported the hadith of the Prophet. So now we should think about it that kept standing in will prayer be one of the so long that the and feet, now that you are prepared, the skin of his feet would crack. understand what I asked him. Why it's would now you do this? While you what can you do that given your faith, your former life? Will you put the effort to do more with these last 10 days? A grateful servant. And as a final note, before I had a grateful servant of Allah, may. And that's Allah's in Surah Allah, 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 and forgive our sins if we all, may we we all become better so, humans in practice. Now we should think about it better than tonight before we will not only is Ramadan the best time you are to do prepared and you of remembering Allah's understand what can happen but it's also time to think giving out what can you do that strengthens your faith and will you put the effort to do more with these last 10 days. There are a lot of as a final note and for a half I forgot what was the they, other one called. Like, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless us all like, and forgive our sins. May we all, they're currently working we to all become the better humans and practice the best of knowledge and better than people for. And, and not only is treat, Ramadan the best time to and maximum like a final of thing, remembering just to treat Allah's all these ten nights, but let's also and spend time in good deeds. And so they'll call for the ones who are worthy of deeds. As some people started Ramadan the day earlier or day before, there are a lot either way, each night is really special and it's a great opportunity to worship. That was the other one called. I hope you learned something new. And if you haven't checked out the last two, I think guys of Ramadan basket this from not to check that out and if you like me to talk about anything else treat Islamic related and any, or like anything final related thing, just to treat I can all these that as soon as possible and spend and time in good deeds oh yeah I can research and spend time in good deeds as some people started and Ramadan the thank day you for earlier, listening day before this is hard really to, either way each night is very special and it's a great opportunity to worship and I hope you learned something new and if you haven't checked out the last two episodes of the Ramadan series maybe check that out and if you like me to talk about anything else islamic related or any or anything related i can upload that as soon as possible and oh yeah i can research and upload that as soon as possible and thank you for listening this is Haris Bakar and i'm out